Hi everyone, Dr. Ray Benedetto here today with a short video, uh, much more of a case study actually. I, I wanted to to review some of these uh, principles and, and and foundational things that we talk about in regards to our health. This is actually a case study of a patient of ours, and we're going to go over this. And, and and I don't do this to to brag and show how great our our treatment uh, protocols are and things like that, but really just to show you what's possible. You know, when you take your health into your own hands and you're armed with knowledge and you uh, think outside the box, uh, especially the traditional medical box, um, the, the types of improvements that we can make. This is a patient of ours who we've been seeing for, for quite some time. And a couple of years back, uh, she, came, she came to me and, and we sat down and we spoke and she was very concerned about uh, her osteoporosis. She has osteoporosis and it had been getting significantly worse, a lot worse. Um, and I have some evidence here to show you. And she asked for our help and uh, just want to kind of show you with some, with some simple nutritional uh, changes and some, and some very effective supplements and things how we were able to help uh, a really significant problem. Um, I'm assuming most of those who are watching this know that osteoporosis is when um, when you lose the, uh, the the matrix, you lose the structure and the bone. The bones get your bones get really weak. Um, and what's used to monitor how bad the damage is or how it's improving is something called a DEXA scan. So I have a couple of scans here. This one, and you probably won't be able to see it too well in this video, but I'll read it to you. But this one here, and, and I've highlighted some of the areas you can see where which are the real bad stuff. This one's from uh, December 30th, 2014. So. Um, the end of 2014, so almost three years ago. And um, what they did was this patient had had a DEXA scan in 2008. So 2008 to 2014. What they do is they measure the bone mass, the mineral density in the lower back, so the lumbar spine, and both hips, right and left hip. Okay. So they compared this one to the one in 2008. Okay. This was when she asked for our help. And basically what had happened was in the lower back, there was 23.8% more bone loss compared to the one in 2008. So 2008 to 2014, 23% increase in the bone loss in the lumbar spine, the low back. The left hip, 21% loss. The right hip, 27% loss. Okay, significant loss of bone in six years on a 54 year old woman okay this is not good this is not good um, fract fracture risk is very high significant loss of bone mineral density from the prior examination okay and she had been she's been dealing with this for years I mean 2008 was the first scan you know and she had been on all the medications and all that kind of stuff so let's fast forward so she asked for our help back then a couple of years back so let's fast forward. This is the most recent one, and this was in October of this year, so October of 2017. Okay, obviously I've crossed out the patient's name. <laughs> Can't show you that. Um, so this is from October 2017, and they compared it to the one from December of 2014. Lumbar spine. Compared to the prior study, bone density has not shown any significant change. So this is great. This is great news. Sure, it didn't get significantly better, but it stopped getting worse. Okay, on the previous one, there was a 23% loss of bone from 2008 to 2014. 2014 to 2017, it has not changed. There's no more loss. That's great. Um, in the right hip, in the right hip, not only has there been no more loss in bone density. There's actually been an increase in bone density. 12.4% increase in bone density in the right hip. The left hip, 8.5% increase. Again, didn't only just stop, actually increased the bone mass, which had previously been a snowball rolling downhill. Again, these are statistically significant. So interval increase in bone density compared in the hips compared to the prior study. Uh, this is huge. And she, 
She was crying in her office. She was thrilled about this, and I, I'm th I was thrilled about it too. This is great. And this was just with some simple dietary work and some nutritional supplements and things that we were doing for her targeted to help her problem, to help slow down, at least slow down and stop the bone loss, and then to regain of, as much of it as we can. So, you know, she was in tears because she said, you know, for 15 years, her bones had only been getting worse, and she was scared you know, what was going to happen. She's, you know, she's now 57, you know, she's got a lot of living left to do. So she didn't want her bones to just deteriorate. So she had a huge decrease in the bone mass from the prior two. And then since we started working with her, she's no more bone loss in the lumbar spine. And then she's actually had an increase of 12% in the right hip, 8% in the left hip. That is great stuff that is really cool stuff we were thrilled for her we were so happy to to, to be able to help her um with that and 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 she was very thrilled also I was, I was very pleased um so just a little case study some of the things that we do here in our office that um you know many of you might think well geez i, I wouldn't have even considered that i just i got my osteoporosis i'm taking my, my my medications it's not working or it's continuing to get worse like what else can i do what other options do i have so these are kind of the kind of things that we see in our office every day and uh, wanted to share that with you. If you have any questions, uh, feel free to um, respond to this video, uh, email or comment. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. Um, if you have any questions, you can always reach out to us and contact our office about anything health related. This was a great case study for, uh, for osteoporosis, uh, one of our patients that's, that's doing really well. So if you have any questions or comments, go ahead and uh, just let us know. Everyone have a great day.